I, I don't, I don't think I'm hidden. No, I was trying to make like an amazing intro, but I don't think I can keep out, outperforming my last intro, but I tried. So imagine you can't see me. Hi guys. Oh, <laughs> hi guys, welcome back to Hobby Bowl. My name is Skylar and let's get right into the video. Today, I got a little bit inspired. I have this weird room. You guys are sitting on top of a hot tub right now and you can probably hear by the echoing. This was like a room inside my house that had a hot tub in it. Now, the hot tub, amazing, but it started leaking and when it started leaking because it's inside the house, it leaked into my office and that's a no-go. So I was like, huh, let's turn this room into a hobby room. Now, my progress on this room is gonna be a little bit slow because I have A, a giant hot tub in the middle of this room and B, unassembling it or selling it or whatever is kind of a hard thing to do right now. So I'm gonna show you what this room looks like and kind of what my ideas are for it. And it is going to become my painting room. So it's kind of like a little room tour. It is green. It is green and brown. It's not the best color scheme, but I'm working with what I got and hopefully we can get a bunch of really awesome projects done in it. So yeah, let's go. I have my Hama Hama diorama that I'm working with and it has literal like grass pieces in it. Maybe I should have hit behind those. Maybe I can retry that intro. Hey, oi. Oh, oh, you can't see me. You can't see me. Yeah. Welcome back to Hobby Bowl. <laughs> uh, nothing's gonna beat that first intro. But anyways, yeah, stick around. This Hama Hama, I got a really great idea from one of my subscribers to turn Hama Hama into Poison Ivy. And I have, I have massive ambitions for this kit to be extremely cool. So I'm pulling out all the stops and this project is gonna be in the future. So again, stick around. I am trying, I'm trying to do all these cool things. I wanna share so much with everybody, but you can't rush perfection. You can't, well, you can't rush art. You can rush art, but it's not gonna be amazing. But stick around for this one at the very least. So let's get into the, hmm. Let's make it like MTV Cribs. Like, yo, check out this room, it's awesome. It's gonna be my room that I build and paint plastic mechs in. Oh, it's so awesome. No, we're not doing that. All right, let's go. Let's get into the video. Thank you guys, bye. So, we are going to go into the room from my gym here and we're gonna check it out. So, welcome, 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 welcome to my weird party room that has a hot tub in it. Now, this house was built in like 1990 and these guys were ahead of the time. They're like, you know what? I want to put a speaker system and I want this to be a total party room. They even added a fan up here for, you know, the water and condensation to actually leave outside. So I'm like, whoa. This is perfect for my airbrush setup that I can literally just put the hose out right there through the window and it goes outside and I have that. Now it's gonna be super loud because between the airbrush and between the filter system here, it's pretty loud. But yeah, like, I mean, there's not much more to it. It has, like, oop, it has a hot tub. Just, just, just a hot tub, a hot tub sitting there. And what I ultimately want to do is I want to get rid of all of this and put like tables completely around the whole entire like room here. But for now, I think, you know, I have the stool here. I can just sit here and work on my airbrush and my kits and stuff like that. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with this white wall. I painted this white because I just wanted to get rid of some of the green with like some leftover paint that I had and I might start cutting my kits so that, like the, the boxes for my kits and actually put them there and then I wanna actually put kits on that back wall. 
Um, and then I've started getting a couple organizational things here. Now, <laughs> look at how, how uneven this line is that I did here. I don't even know what I was just painting and I was like, oh, let's try and do a line. It's like, good, 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 good. <laughs> but um, also this was like a really ugly shelf. Like you remember these from like the early nineties, they were like at the Michael store and everything like that. And they had hearts on them. Everything had hearts on them. It was like a whole collection. So I just painted it gray. As you can see, I started putting my stuff up here and yeah. So hold on, let me, let me get you flipped back around here. And ba -ba 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 -ba. yeah. So this is pretty much it. Um, that's it. It's a decent sized room. I think the biggest thing is that I have the ability to just take the actual exhaust hose and put it directly outside. And it's pretty cool. So, oh, <laughs> the lighting in here is not very good. It has like these old school little lights, which I am going to replace, but for the time being, I'm just gonna leave it alone. But yeah, let's set it right here. And that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it. Um, I got, this is like the coolest thing ever. I don't know how you guys probably arrange stuff. I use a nail polish rack. Um, I have a giant one that's on order, like a like 120 bottle one that's coming in. And I'm going to put it on one of these walls here. Actually, probably all the walls. So if you guys have any any suggestions for like organizational things, I was looking at this thing from Ikea. It's like a workbench that has like a pegboard on it. But that's why it's kind of exciting. It's gonna take me a while to really make this room exactly the way that I want it to be. But once it's done, it's just gonna be so cool and I can't wait. The biggest thing is getting rid of this hot tub. So does anyone want a hot tub? <laughs> Actually, no, honestly, I still want to use the hot tub and like put it outside because it was a good hot tub, but it just can't be inside of the house. But yeah, I'm gonna like decorate it and everything like that and it's pretty straightforward. So I, I feel very fortunate that I actually have a room like this to be able to do something. And I just think it would be a really great space to utilize for actual model building, right? And then another thing that I like to do by the way, so this is from the Origin um, manga. This is RX78 version one. And tell me that's not like the most badass picture you have ever seen. Like, oh, and then there's like a, another scene that has like the Zaku on it. I'll input it. Greatest scene ever. Like. It's crazy. I, I use like this crazy frame that I got and I put it in. And another thing, Kshatriya actually got it inside of things. This frame right here, and then I have wing. So I'm just gonna do stuff like this to probably go ahead and decorate the room, but that's pretty much it. If you guys have any suggestions for organizational things that I can do or shelves or just ideas like it's an open canvas right now and i just find that so awesome and amazing and i can't wait until the hot tub's out and i can use the whole entire room for exactly what i want to use it for but yeah that's pretty much it for the video today guys i wanted to do a really quick video have some more practice on doing videos and stuff like that thank you for watching again as always don't forget hey, to like comment listen. subscribe check out my instagram community and that's it okay have a good day guys Bye! See ya later. Much!